decided to make boxy today. Now, I got a request from Mark, so Mark, this is for you. Boxy, it is a a famine time bread. It has protein, carbohydrate, vegetables, all in one meal. It is a vegetarian style boxy. So, we will start with the potato. This potato has been previously baked and chilled. Now, I'm going to peel this potato like so. We're going to peel it a little bit and pull the peel down so you don't like waste as much of the potato as you possibly can. Right? So we we'll peel all the potato nice and round like that. And after I finish this peel the potato, I will have a shredder or a grater and I will grate this into the bowl. And then we will follow up with the rest of the ingredients. But you see how I get... Now, if you choose, you can actually shred the skin of the potatoes in there as well as long as they're well washed before I have my grater right here and I have my my bowl and I shred it right into the bowl and there you go we shred one whole potato right into the bowl wonderful I have actually more potatoes right here that I shredded earlier to, to mix into this bowl to make more boxes <laughs> The next thing that I add in here is actually going to be my flour. All purpose flour, one cup. And we make sure that the flour has um, more or less separated all the little uh, shreds of potato. So they don't stick together. And what we do is we want an, an even cake. So after this, we will add our egg. I have an egg right here. I'll beat that egg right there at that. In it goes. And our famous Mr. Ranlu Dairy's buttermilk. And we take some of the leeks that we and we put them in there. So then we tumble this together, we've got our eggs, buttermilk, our shredded potatoes, our flour, and our leeks. We will add some salt and pepper to the mix. And that is your boxy mix. So now we are going to mold the boxies and cook them on a flat top. Now if I was at home I would probably cook these on a cast iron skillet. But in industry we do have uh, flat tops which is very does the exact same thing it's just level and easier to use. So I do use a scoop to measure and shape my boxies and they go on like so. So today we're going to make a brunch box because we're coming into the weekend for brunch and I'm going to put into the brunch boxy is bacon and Cheshire pork sausage which is from Cheshire Farms, North Carolina and um, we will put that to bring that together with a cream sauce and, and we'll put it on top of the boxies and we'll have a finished product for brunch tomorrow. So we're looking for about maybe three to four minutes each side. Um, not to touch them, not so much, so you kind of have to let them, let, them, let them sizzle and go. about four minutes either side and um, while they're finishing off cooking I'm just going to make the sauce for the vegetarian boxy. We have a basic bechamel sauce here which is reduced milk and a roux which is a flour mixture and um, that is brought together. We will start up a fire here. I have a, a combination of parsley and green onions which I'll toss it right in there at that. I would also like to add a little bit of white wine and some 
and a very, very decent whole grain mustard. Bring those together, and it makes a very, very simple, rich, creamy sauce, which will complement those hearty, boxy cakes. We'll put them onto the plate as such. Finish right on top with the whole grain mustard, parsley, and green onion.